I cannot believe I'm making this video. Now this TV had a gray screen with backlight on and nothing else. So I changed the motherboards and same result. I ordered them from Shop Jimmy and still the same black screen, backlight and nothing else. So I saw this video on the internet and this guy says that you have to cut the lines going to the LCD. So I'm like, no way. I mean, why would you want to do that? So but anyway, I had nothing to lose. So I went ahead and I cut these lines on this TV. And lo and behold, it starts working. Look. Okay, so what I did first, what I, when I got the boards from Shop Jimmy, I swapped the power board, then tried the main board, tried the TCOM board. Now what you do is you disconnect one of these cables and see what side turns on. So if you disconnect this cable and it's white, then it's all right. And if you disconnect this cable, and you get a display on either one of those then they're all right then you can isolate the problem if you're getting the display by having this connected and this off then you work on this side so if you get the display with this connected and this off then you work on this side so for in my case when I connected this side this side of the panel turned on just fine and when I connected both of them I was getting the black screen again so what I did was I connected both of them and then I started cutting on the dead side so I just had to cut four of these wires and the whole thing started working 